I think the thing that most distinguishes the taste of Gulf seafood has everything to do with the water temperature and what these uh, fish and shellfish are eating. And so these are warm waters and these are very fertile waters. And so I think that the seafood that we have has um, almost a sweet uh, flavor to it. Our crab meat um, by far is the best crab meat that you're going to find in the country. Since the BP oil spill, I don't think that there's been seafood more closely scrutinized. I don't know if there's a food more scrutinized than the seafood coming from our coast. And what's in the market today is probably at a higher grade than it ever has been. So what we're gonna serve tomorrow for Dine America will be shrimp and crab meat and oysters and redfish folded into a couple of our favorite dishes like our redfish kubion. Um, which has kind of a variety of all of that. Crab meat served with our potato gnocchi and fresh shaved truffles. That's a hit at August and that's something that no menus should be without. Well, Sophie, welcome to New Orleans. It's great to have you here. Well, it's great to be here. Let's especially food that way. Especially here at Restaurant August. So I'm thrilled to death that a gallo is actually here to, to sample some of our Thank food. Thank you. Well, I'm getting hungry, so don't start too much. <laughs> More importantly, I think it's great that you're here for for the fishermen and to really get the word out about what's happening here in the Gulf and especially in these coastal communities that supply us with all this great seafood. So I hope you don't mind if I cook up a little something for no, you No, that's what I came for in Dine America <laughs> to help the fishermen. My name is Phil Cusimano and I am not a professional bartender, but I am a local and I am fortunate enough to be working with Southern Comfort tonight. We're here to support Gulf Seafood and Dine America. What we're bringing to the table tonight is we are bringing the Nola Hatton which it's good to bring this because Southern Comfort is a brand that was born on Bourbon Street in New Orleans and to partner with the seafood and make a good drink is going to be fun. I'm going to take you through it step by step. What we're going to do is first you take your Southern Comfort 100 proof, not the regular 70 because it's going to represent the drink a little better and we're going to do an ounce and a half and that's a count and a half and what I like to say is one New Orleans two. And then what we're going to do is a half ounce of sweet vermouth, just a little splash just like that and then what we're going to take is some Tabasco hot sauce and we're just going to put a dash of that in there. Then what you're doing is what they say, shake vigorously. And then what we're going to do, take a chilled martini glass. We're going to take it, we're going to strain the drink in the glass. And then take one of these beautiful Louisiana Gulf shrimp, garnish it on the side. And there we have the Nola Hatton. I believe that Southern Comfort cares so much about Louisiana because it is a brand that was born in New Orleans on Bourbon Street. There's not many brands who can say that. And if you look at what Southern Comfort has done for New Orleans and Louisiana, we've just done Gulf Aid, Gulf Relief, where we've donated $250,000 already. We've done sponsored French Quarter Fest. We do Voodoo Fest. We sponsor many local events. And we care about the city, we care about our bartenders, and we care about Bourbon Street. And have always been on this march to bring bring the city back from Katrina and to get it back to where it was, which I believe it is, and support the restaurants, the seafood, and the bars and restaurants. And that's why I believe that we're here to stay, we're here to help out, and we're here for Dine America. Okay, uh, Brian Katz, executive chef of Redfish Grill on Bourbon Street, the gateway to the French Quarter in New Orleans. And uh, we're celebrating Dine America, which is uh, promoting the awareness of our bountiful seafood from the Louisiana Gulf. And today we're going to be doing a little bit of uh, Louisiana Gulf Jumbo Shrimp with the Southern Comfort barbecue sauce and some stone ground grits. So we're gonna get to it. We have some lovely head-on shrimp straight from the Gulf. I'm gonna use a little kosher salt, a little black pepper, and then we're gonna move right over here. We have a screaming hot pan, as you can see. A little bit of canola oil. And we're gonna slip the shrimp right in there. They're gonna cook very, very quickly. And we're just going to let them cook on one side. We're going to flip them and then we're going to flame them with Southern Comfort. Okay, now we're going to turn them over. All right. Take a little Southern Comfort. Flame on. 
Add a tiny bit of shallots. A little bit of garlic. Some Worcestershire sauce. A little lime juice. Fresh squeezed, of course. And we have a little bit of butter. It's going to round out the sauce nicely. And this is New Orleans, so we're not shy on the butter. And we're just going to kind of create a nice little pan sauce. Flip them over so they get their ni that nice lovely sauce on there. And we're going to finish up. We have some lovely stone ground white grits. Nice and creamy. And our shrimp's just about ready. We'll line them up around. And there you have your Southern Comfort Barbecue Shrimp with Stone Ground Grits.